then the tree diagram becomes a lot harder to make, right? So if you have smaller samples, then it's very easy to make the tree diagram. For example, something like this. So uh, let's say uh, this figure summarizes the possible outcome for a true false followed by multiple choice. So true false, the first question is the true false, it has only two answers. And the multiple choice has a uh, possible five answers. And they're totally independent, right? So if you want to find out how, what's the sample space uh, of the true false, it's only two. And sample space for the what? Multiple choice is five. So two times five, these are corresponding what? Outcomes in the sample space. So you can answer as a true A, true B, true C, true D, true E, then F A, F B, and so on. So it's very easy to make a, a table if you have smaller sample space. Any questions so far?